Yes gang, what is going on? I'm loving home training life. Little project today that I've been looking to do for a while now. We're gonna make some modified strongman equipment. You might have seen in one of my previous videos that I did some sort of budget carries using some lifting straps. I'll put the link or the card, whatever. Today, we're gonna to make a sandbag it's using stuff that I've already got in the home. Got a bit of a setup in the garage, but one thing I'm missing is a sandbag. I've not been able to do any sort of like modified strongman other than in that previous vlog where I did some carries. So today, I'm gonna to be making some sandbags. So if you're into things like carries or weighted carries, someone like StrongFit, Julian Pinot, really good resource. Also, Andrew Tracy, who's again, all about modifying or using what you have to get where you wanna go. Like I've said previously, I'm not a strongman, but it doesn't mean that we can't bring elements of strongman or modified strongman into our training. With these joints, these skinny wrists and skinny elbows, I'm never gonna be half Thor Bjornsson, but there's so much benefit that we can start bringing into our training. And let's not be dogmatic. Yes, I love calisthenics and bodyweight training, but there's certain things or certain movement patterns that we can't necessarily mimic through using body weight alone. Why not utilize the right tool for the job? Oh yeah, ignore the garden. It's a work in progress. Cat's getting quite hot. Okay. The cats have got all the beds and all the nice things in the world, but they prefer an old my protein box. <laughs> Being silly. These were bags that I picked up from a army supplies store and they've been sat in the shed for ages. 8th of April, 2017. You can hardly see it so faded. I've been planning on this a little while. I've just needed the impetus to do it. So lockdown has been the ideal opportunity. So the plan is to use all this unused pea gravel, fill it into bags and then load those bags in smaller denominations into those carry bags. Load it into the sacks, those smaller packages, and then wrap those up and then load them into there so that you can adjust or modify how much weight you're lifting each time. guys it's been a while since I filmed the first segment of this vlog or talking you through how to sandbag carry but shout out to Brian of Heavy for reaching out to me he saw some of my posts and how like, I enjoy strongman training and he's got a sick new company called Heavy and they specialize in sandbags ideal like for carriers and sort of strongman style training boy so check that out I think their logo is sick. Got like the inners. This, this is the best bit. Yo, look at that. How cool is that? So this was the main thing I was looking at. I think their branding is like on point. Super sick. So these come in two sizes. I believe there's a 20 kilogram one and a 50 kilogram one, but obviously you've got to fill it up with sand or gravel or whatever. That's my intention. larger one of the two and then there's a smaller one here so that's velcro open that up fill it up slam it in the big boy big guy i should say and there's a smaller one as well so all the links and everything i'll stick in the description i will get filling this now and then take it for a test run Now, 
I should say at this point, not everyone needs to wash their rocks, but these have been sat in soil and have been there for a while. So I wanted to clean them up before I chuck them in the bag. tell just by stringing a few compound exercises together combined with the instability and the awkwardness of something like a sandbag it really sort of gets your heart rate going but also you stabilizing muscles so something of an equivalent weight in a barbell or even a kettlebell will feel easier than than something like this let me know if you want to see any more sort of workouts i've given you a little idea but maybe you want to incorporate something like strongman or carries into your training or how you intend to do that all the information to this is in the links below so shout out again to heavy appreciate them reaching out to me but uh, i anticipate this being a staple part of my training from now on and just just fun to move low tech equipment high tech body or at least that's the aim <laughs>